What's going on, Pop Sugar fam? It is your boy, Supernatural Coach Rainier Pollard, and I am here with a 15-minute booty burn workout. I have Leilani about to do my modifications, and Chelsea gonna hang with me all the way through. All you need to do is bring some beautiful energy. Let's do this! Yeah. <laughs> All right now fam, let's get right into it. We're gonna get ourselves into a half squat position. Slight bend in the knees, belly button in. I want us to focus on trying to push through our leg to stand tall and get a little bit of balance here. Now, there is a modification to this. If you don't feel that you can pull this knee all the way up to the chest, you can just drive the knee high. It'll still warm those hip flexors up. But if you are getting into the balance challenge, know that you are preparing yourself for the brunt of today's leg work, okay? You can't say I didn't try to warn you. We are gonna balance a lot, which I think is a great way to connect to yourself and connect to your patients. That is a big aspect of this life, so practice it. You will see me fall off balance. I'm gonna tell it to you right now. Get your expectations good and right, okay? So, to prevent myself from falling off balance, I'm gonna try to push into my big toe as well as driving through my heel. Now from here, I'm gonna give that same half squat and try to go for the ankle, push the ground away, try to get this ankle nice and high, a nice piriformis stretch. And again, you can see that modification of maybe just tapping the ankle instead of trying to hold on to the full heel and stand all the way up tall. This is where I knew I would start to tumble. A little fumble. You just, all you have to do every time you fumble, instead of getting annoyed with yourself, I want you to say, thank you for being here. Thank you for putting in this work today and challenging yourself. Ooh. You're gonna hear me say that a lot then. If you didn't know that that was what was about to come at you, know it right now. <laughs> now let's go into a fuller squat. If you need to modify by keeping it into a half squat, I understand. All about that range of motion. I'm getting myself a little side leg lift, activating this glute med. It is a lower body workout, so powers of the glute med activate. That is where the shelf of the booty is created, so I know. I'm doing, you know, the Lord's work when I work it. Hello! <laughs> Give people something to look at when you're walking away. It's community service. I've said it before. I can I repeat can't. jokes. I can repeat jokes. Last couple moments here. As you can see, I'm still taking my time. This is still warm up. I'm being responsible. From here, we're gonna go to a kickback. Just flex that glute. Take that heel towards the back of your space. Push the ground away. That is the number one thing I want you to focus on. As much as the leg in the air is giving you really good work, the leg that is on the floor is what we're focusing on. You're trying to look like, you know, a flamingo. I feel like I'm shouting Florida out. I am from Miami, that's not exactly Florida. There's an argument to be had. We can talk <laughs> in the comments, we can talk in the comments. But um, yes, we have, we, Florida is known for the flamingo. They just stand on one leg and look beautiful, okay? <laughs> Some people have said that about me when I'm in a balanced workout, so you know. So invoke that same spirit and push this leg back. Last couple moments, hello. And if you catch the spirit, say something about it. I love it. All right, rest. <laughs> now, going into here, I want us to practice our airplanes. One at a time, we're gonna get a good hinge focusing on driving that belly button in. If you can get your upper body parallel to the ground, do it. Do not um, judge yourself if from side to side you feel like it, there's one, one side that's way harder to deal with than the other. That is life. Let's just get into the work of it all. Now, you may notice that the modification here is not going to as extreme of an angle in your airplane. Last couple moments here, and what we're gonna do is add a squat in between each one of these airplanes. You take a moment, drive that belly button in, lower this booty, push out, and get right into that airplane. Side to side, breathing through, taking your time. We're on a journey today. Mm -hmm. I hear that. <laughs> it's one of those things where when you work the lower body, it's gonna get that heart rate up. It's a big old muscle group, right? 
Yep. But here we're not focusing on the cardio aspect of it all. We're just moving and loving every little second of it. Dropping it low and pushing through that working leg. So I want you to focus in on really activating through your core, through your center. Your abs are the link between your arms and your legs. And when you keep them stable, your arms and legs are able to do their work with more efficiency. Hello. You know, I'm just trying to preach. But um, the truth of the matter is, as much as we're working this booty and focusing in on it, the rest of your body should be working here as well. I'm focusing on getting my arms and my heel up towards the sky, which is definitely gonna be getting in to that back work. Last moments here. Let's stand tall, you can shake it out, shake it out. If at any time the low back is feeling a lot of pressure, you can try to march a little bit, loosen things up. From here, we're adding on a reverse lunge. So we squat, reverse lunge, push through that front leg, and get that Ooh. airplane. That's the spirit. That. Right back into it. Squat, reverse lunge, and right into that airplane. So I made these really long intervals because I don't want you focused on speed. I want you focused on form. I want you focused on connecting to your body. Breathing through, trying to find your length in that body as you enter into that airplane. Keep your upper body nice and long. The leg that's in the air is staying nice and active. Reverse and then push through. I'm pretending I'm on a beach right now. <laughs> All these planes <laughs> in Miami the with these flingos. Are there some shirtless men's is playing volleyball? <laughs> oh, do not start with me about volleyball. <laughs> Girl, that might be me in a speedo. <laughs> Wave hello. Wave hello. Bring me hello. a little drink. <laughs> okay. Be a good neighbor. <laughs> Finish that last rep. And we're going to stand tall and prepare for our next exercise. So I want us to stay low and really just get into these legs here. We're getting squat walks. Two walks to the side. Focus on that outside leg moving first. That will come in handy later. So it's one open, two open, and back. Now, if you get tired before the interval is over, what are you allowed to do? Stand up and shake it out and join me right back down here. We're not here to judge. We're here to work this body, get a good challenge in there and show this body some love. We're more than halfway through this interval. If it helps you when you open up, you can pop, pop. You know what I mean? Get a little dance, baby, go pop, pop. If that's the inspiration that you need to stay down here, you know I'm on your side. Last eight seconds. Ooh. Ooh. Hey, you know what I mean? That. We in the club today now. <laughs> that's exactly how I want you to feel. Okay, rest. Very good job. Now, as you can see, we are building on each one of our movements and all we're gonna add in is an airplane on that outside leg before sitting low and moving that outside leg first. Push off, get that glute med good and activated. Let's start down low and with an airplane, go. Open strong, sit it low. And yes, believe in yourself. Believe that you are only getting more and more warmed up. So as much as I like to have good appropriate expectations, I do love to believe. Believe in your booty. Hello, oh my gosh, can I get that on a shirt? <laughs> believe in the power of the booty. It's always right behind you trying to give you the support you need. Okay. The support you crave. Hey, I love it. So, this is only gonna make your relationship better. If I'm making you giggle and that's affecting your balance, that's extra credit, okay? If it's making you flex those abs even more, good. <laughs> Workout and comedy show. That's, that's my entire brand right there. There we go. Last moments here, I started on this side, so I wanna end on the other. But I will say the progression is going to be that we just add on a reverse lunge and finish it good and even. Now we're in our little rest period, so if you wanna beat on these quads because you're feeling a lot of the love, do it, do it. You don't even have to ask consent, they're yours, baby, they're oh, yours. Yeah. 
Now, next up in this progression, you already know, the inside leg is coming back into the reverse lunge, and then we push into an airplane, open up, open up, sit down low, and then again, pushing from the outside leg over the other side, one more, plant it, take it back, push through. If you understand, please join me and get into the fun. If you're wondering, is that dance option still on? You already know. You can even do this, push it in the side of in the <laughs> lunge too, okay? You're getting me too hyped. <laughs> is there such a thing? Turn down for what? Um, you were the main one showing me that <laughs> Off, um, that offset twerk. That's why I'm here for it, okay? <laughs> She's here to twerk. <laughs> Some Miley Cyrus To twerk moments. and work. Ooh, push back. Now again, if you want to get into the modification by just abbreviating your range of motion, you could start with that reverse lunge. You do not have to drop this knee too low. But if you'd like to take it all the way down, even tapping the ground, that option is open. If you're feeling the spirit, and your body feels up to that challenge. Last couple here, pushing through and letting this body do what it do. Finishing good and even, baby. Abs tight. The abdominals are going through a lot. I want the low back to feel supported by making the abdominals nice and tight and active. Stand up out of it. We're gonna get more into some plyometrics in a moment. Right now, we're going down low, pulsing in the squat for three, two, one. Lateral jump to the side or modification, little skip, just push off that outside leg. Three, two, one, little skip over. Or if you're feeling the spirit, big jump up high and to the side. You see how light that landing was? Feeling like a ninja. Yeah! <laughs> Three, two, one. Exhale and over. Three, two, one. Pushing through my heels predominantly on this pulse. Control to control. Boom. Ooh. Ooh. It's burning. It is, but I feel so ready for this right now. <laughs> I'm really happy about how much I warmed this up today. It's never a bad time to pat yourself on the back. I'm being a role model without mm -hmm. that right now. And rest. Okay, now that little beat on the quads moment, that's for you at any time you wanna have it. I know you already know what the progression's gonna be. We are not pulsing it in the squat anymore though. It is a squat, reverse lunge on the inside leg. Bring it right back to the squat, up and over, or that skip. Back and squeeze that booty. You can do it on the beat. You didn't back tell me this was a jumping contest. In. Exhale, what you say? You didn't tell me this is a jumping contest. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't need to be a contest, but if you're trying to give me a challenge, I'll take it. I can't even see, but I will just assume I'm winning. It's the kind of I mean, confidence you're much I was taller, born much with. Taller. <laughs> I mean, height, I see that. I know, I know some shorter people that know how to get it, know how to really push. Now, I want to say, keep that front leg with the majority of your weight when you go into that reverse lunge. And I also want to say, I understand that you're probably burning right now. Oh yeah. And oh my if God. you need to slow these down by giving me more pulses in the squat, I'm with you on that. We're finishing right here though. Reverse, bring it in. I'm gonna jump and land. Oh. Stand on that. Okay. Yikes. Last little exercise. Let's earn it. Show me what you learned today. The squat, the lunge, the airplane. Every time you jump, I want it to be a jump for joy, okay? It's a celebration of all the work we just put into these legs. So make it good and powerful. Act like it's your last one every single time. Now, if I fly through this roof, you see all this debris just come down and I'm just gone, let me be. Let me go. I'm free, okay? I'll send a postcard from wherever I go. The beach with the volleyball players. It might be <laughs> with those cuties with some shirts off. That's me on most Sundays. You can find me, okay? Which beach? There's a metallic speed on one, so I, I stand out. Hey, You'll know from the street. Is that Rainier in the shimmering speedo? <laughs> now you may notice, especially when I try to tell a joke, I fall a little bit. But one thing I do right away, 
is try to use my arm to open up nice and strong. Every time my legs get in there, or every time my arms and legs really force themselves to the sky, even when I feel like I'm falling off balance, I'm able to really deal with it. We're making this last set one long one, okay? Oh yeah, we did Get it. Get into the endurance of it all, keep powering through. If you're with me, you're on the last two. Fight strong, fight strong, body long. Yes. Come on, got big it. finish, big finish. I wanna jump back though, I wanna jump back. Final one here, let's jump like we mean it. Competition, take a picture, who won? Ah! <laughs> All right, now stand it up, stand it up, shake it out. We're gonna cool it on down now, so if you wanna rewind right now and get this whole workout again, you know that I support you, but if you're ready for this cool down, let's get right into it. Put one foot out in front and give me a slight bend in the knee, your stable knee. Pushing the hips back, trying to lift your hips nice and high, getting a nice stretch right behind the back of the leg. You can pressure into that thigh to help it just a bit, or even just to help your stability. Although right now, I'm sure you're feeling very balanced. We've had a lot of practice. Let's take in one deep soothing breath, giving me a long back to try to help stretch that back body. Inhale. Exhale to push through the ground and stand tall. Take that same leg back in space. You can drop the heel to get a little bit of a calf stretch. And I want us to stretch our hip flexor by flexing the glutes. So we're stretching the opposite muscle group. I'm going to poke my booty just a bit, just to make sure it's on, it feels strong. Okay, then I'm gonna lean into my hip just a little bit more until I feel a comfortable stretch. Take that same arm overhead for a bit of a back bend, chest up to the sky. Inhale, reaching back. Exhale to stand up tall. That wasn't exactly a modified range of motion. She went longer than me. Don't look better than me in this. I'm just playing. I don't, I'm just playing. <laughs> you were giving me the line. I had to take my moment. It was so long was and graceful. Statue <laughs> Let's get the other side. Put that foot out in front, slight bend in the knee, and then scoop the hip just a bit. How much can you raise that booty? Again, that same option for support. If you even wanted to reach down towards the toe and get a little bit more of a stretch, you can. Let's take in that deep breath together. Inhale. Exhale, push the ground the way, stand tall. Let's finish it off. Stepping back, pushing the heel down, flexing the glute, leaning into the hip. Getting the long, graceful line. <laughs> Inhale, reach back, chest up and open. Exhale to stand on tall, shake it off, shake it off, and give yourselves a round of applause. Amazing job, thank you for <laughs> joining me. We got Leilani over here killing it, Chelsea, and you know me, Coach Rainier Pollard, who will see you here next time on Class Fit Sugar. <laughs>